about four months ago now, uh, I was standing on the touchline with uh, Jo Chandler, who's on the Board of Governors here at St Saviour's. And in fact, she's the chair. Uh, we were supporting our children who play for a local football team. Uh, jo told me about a recent Ofsted report, told me about the initiatives that St Saviour's were uh, pushing in terms of uh, children's reading. Uh, from that, it sparked a, a visit to the school. Uh, I kind of was taken straight away when I met the pupils, the teachers, the atmosphere here. Uh, and since then our relationship has grown and grown. Um, and from that has spawned the idea of refurbishing the library and the whole Books for Children campaign that we've recently been involved in. The Oakland Group's worked in Lewisham Borough now for nearly three decades. Uh, projects like this give uh, a business like ours the perfect opportunity to support what is clearly a worthwhile cause uh, and above all else get really involved with the local community that supported us for so many years. We started the Books for St Saviour's campaign uh, just before we started the building work actually um, and it was a call for any unwanted children's books to be dropped into any of our offices across South East London and Kent and we just can't believe the reaction, it's been incredible. We've had about 2,000 books donated to date with more promised so it's just fantastic, we couldn't have asked for anything more. How can you not love reading after going into that library? It's absolutely fantastic. They'll be able to go up there, they'll be able to pick the books that they want. It would be a space that they can relax on the bean bags. It's going to be fantastic for them. We cannot believe the generosity of the people, of the, the general public. Um, I know that schools have donated, I know that families have donated, and it's really nice for them to have a home to go to. Everyone loves books, nobody wants to throw them away. We can make good use of them here. Everyone's so excited. It's the best thing that's happened to this school in years. It's, it really is absolutely amazing. It's just absolutely incredible. I mean, when we first heard about the project, we were excited, but and we imagined maybe it'd look good, but it looks absolutely breathtaking, right from the bottom of the steps, the journey up the stairs, and then the library just really hits you as you walk in. So it's just absolutely stunning, incredible. It's incredibly important that children show an interest in reading because in where we are situated as well and given the diverse community we have, a lot of our children have English and additional language. So that richness of the text up there, the, all the language rich walls, that's just going to influence and just help improve the children's vocabulary and writing so much. It's just, I um, can't emphasise that enough. We will be using the new library space in a variety of different ways. We're going to have small groups up there for taught sessions. Every class will have a slot each week where they can obviously borrow the books, take them home, enjoy them at home. But the fantastic thing about the new library is that also we have a little intervention space next door. So that space is a premium in any school. So just the fact that we've got an extra space where we can run small interventions, that'll just have such a huge impact on the progress of the children within the school. All the work you see here has been done uh, over the school holiday period. At the beginning of July, we were able to get the contractors in. Uh, we had a six week deadline, uh, got to work to school holidays, uh, and we hit the deadline perfectly. Notable thanks go to Rob Snell of RS Construction who uh, is our main contractor here and has done a fantastic job. Uh, but above all else, what you see around you reflects uh, the pupils, their ideas uh, and how they'd like to see their library. We intend to support further projects like St Saviour's uh, books for schools. Um, we know for sure that the local community uh, wish to support projects of this type, so we're going to take the opportunity to carry this forward now. Um, keep the appeal for um, 
recycling and reuse of books going uh, and we'll be looking at uh, organisations that need our help and support in a similar way.